Good morning from my side as well. I have three topics which I want to discuss with you this morning. This is uh, because in our CTP department we have solutions for every requirement which can come up in a print shop. We think and we are pretty proud of this that we have the most stable laser technology in the market. I will show you about that. And I will give you a little inside view on some new business areas which you can encounter with Heidelberg CTP systems. As I said, we have solution for every format. You see on the top left we have a supersetter A52, A75, which is, which is our small machine. I will come to this a little bit later. On the top right we see the supersetter VLF. This is our very large format machine. So we go from the smallest to the largest um, uh, a format with our machines. Below on the left we have our new machine which is the Supersetter 106 UV. This is a Supersetter which we have worked out together with a, a Swiss, co Swiss company Lusha. We have equipped this with a UV hat so you can image not the thermal plates, you image with all the others but conventional plates with this machine. I come to this a little bit later as well. And we have a Supersetter 106 with a new automation, our so-called auto or dual cassette loader. Also this I'll show you in a minute. At first the Supersetter A52. The A52, the A75 machine, has the smallest floor space in the market. This is very, very beneficial for, for the small print shops because we don't consume so much space. And even, even if it has a loader on top, the small, uh, the small footprint won't get larger because the loader, as I said, comes on top with up to three different formats you can run. We have a supersetter over there and you are invited to see the machine live over there here at the booth. The supersetter A52, A75 has a very low power consumption. So, even if it is imaging plates, it has a power consumption of 700 watt. This is comparable to a hair dryer. That saves money and it saves the environment. And you see below there uh, the, the, the point flexible in automation speed and format. Even this small little baby is upgradable in speed. So you don't need to exchange a machine if you want to have a faster, faster CTP. It is upgradable in automation. You can start manually and you can update the loader at any time later in the field. And it is upgradable in format. What I want to show in, in a few uh, slides is that we have also some security print applications for this. I come to this later and we can show you over there at our Supersetter A52, A75 as well. And this is our big baby, the Supersetter VLF. We have this in three different formats, 145, 162 and 190. Also this machine is upgradable, so you can start with a, with a lower format, we, you can start with a lower performance and you can start with, with lower speed and you can upgrade on site. So your investment in this machine is always secured even if your business develops. This machine develops together with your business. business. We have a loader with this machine with up to six cassettes. That means you can have more than 600 plates online in six different formats. And this is a new one which I um, told you about. This is the Supersetter 106 UV. We have, have made this machine together with a company from Switzerland, Lüscher. They are working with UV machines since many, many years and they have very reliable heads in this. So, we went together and we, we made the Supersetter 106 UV in order to have an image, imaging machine with UV head and Supersetter technology all around it. The maximum throughput of this machine is 25 plays per hour. You can see this machine not on the Heidelberg booth, but you can see it in Hall 5 at the Lüscher booth. And you can get every information here at, he at the Heidelberg booth about this machine as well. But if you want to see it, we have to, have to walk over. And this is the new automation, which we have over there to your right. 
a SuperSetter dual cassette loader for one or two plate formats. It has some nice and fancy features which I want to present to you. It has the smallest floor space uh, for two formats in the, in the industry. And it has an internal turning table. You see it over there. This is an internal turning table which rotates the plate from landscape into portrait format. That means even if you run an ADAP machine as we have it here, you only need a small processor, less investment, and also less running cost for the chemistry. You can see it all over there. Now we come to the, the heart of the machine, the core of the machine, what makes the SuperSetter so reliable. This is the Heidelberg laser head. It is invented and patented by us. It is sealed and covered. There are no moving parts and that makes this uh, laser head so reliable. I will show you what happens. The SuperSetter laser head has 64 individual diets. You see them here. 64 diets. What if in the very unlikely event what happens if one diet fails? At first you will get a message that something's going on in, in the laser so you can replace the, the, laser, the laser module. Secondly, it's not that the entire laser module um, goes, goes down then, but it just looks to the left and the right of the diet which has failed and shut down the shorter array. So the laser module still continues imaging with a, with a larger array of, of diets with the same quality. So as I said, absolute reliable head, even if something happens inside, the machine won't let you down because we have to keep your printing presses busy with that machine because the money is made in the printing presses. Therefore, we are pretty proud of this um, laser head. You can see, you can have up to six laser heads in, in our SuperSetters. You can even have up to 11 in our SuperSetter VLF. You can start slow speed and you can add laser modules if you want to be faster later on. The dual cassette loader is our new device here on Drupa. You can see it over there and I invite you to go over with me to see the dual cassette loader over there. Even if you run the blades from the dual cassette loader, you can load and unload blades manually from the front. Or if you want to make processless blades from the front, which you don't want to run through the processor you have attached to this. I promise that I will uh, uh, say some words about new printing applications. So we have two more things in our SuperSetters. One is the high resolution option. 5080 dpi for high resolution. The good thing is that the high resolution is switchable. So you can run your normal jobs with our SuperSetter with the laser heads and you switch a different resolution and you can make these kind of guillotine jobs and security jobs with the same machine. You don't need a decent machine for making these applications. We can show this over there at the SuperSetter 75. And you see here, this is a plate. It's, it's zoomed out here with 2540 dpi. You see a little kind of saber tooth here and you, you see here the, the center of the star. And if you compare this to the 5080 dpi, you see there are much smoother curves here with this new resolution option. The next thing is our lenticular option. We have two options to make fast and reliable lenticular jobs. You all might know these flips and moves and, and, and things with, with the lenses. We have lenticular resolution adjustment and our screening editor, which makes sure that the, the uh, imaging dots are located directly under the lenses and not at the corner of the lenses. Otherwise, you get mis-images. This doesn't look, look nice. We have, we have examples over, th over there as well. This you can make by two options, which you can optional put in, in the SuperSetter as well. This opens doors for new applications, and you don't have to 
exchange the, the CTP. You can put this all in the CTP you already have. With every supracitter, you see, we have three different cubes here. This is the supracitter. We also have our system service, which we recommend because we have experts, we have remote access to the machine, we can look into the machine, we can see what's wrong with the machine before we even go, go to the customer. That's why we always recommend a system service with these machines as well. And we have our Safira chemicals, plates, and everything around it. These are qualified and tested for the super setter so that you are sure that you have always the best fitting parts all together. So that's why I recommend not only look at the CTP machine as well, but also take a look at all the surroundings which, which has to come with that machine. For sure, the super setter is part of our Pronect integration. Our Pronect workflow integration Make sure that everything in, inside your company is linked together and information are exchanged between the workflow, the presses and the super setter. We have classrooms over there and bookable stations where you can have an inside view on all the applications we can run with our Prenect workflow and our super setters. And the presses as well and the post press as well. Everything is linked together in our Prenect workflow. So where can you find us? As I said, we have a Supersetter 106 with auto cassette loader over there to my left. We have a Supersetter A75, A52 with the high-res application some steps uh, ahead in, in, in this area. And we have a Supersetter 106 UV in Hall 5 at the Lucia Bruce. And if you have interest in that, I can, I can uh, take you and we can go there. That was an overview about what we have here and I invite you to come to me, come to my colleagues and ask if you have further questions about that and I hope you enjoyed the short presentation and I say thank you very much for your attention.